Okay, guys, good morning. Uh, yeah, 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 we are back, guys. Okay, so today we're looking at uh, US 30, crude oil, and Bitcoin. So the beauty about Bitcoin, guys, is that it works on, it even runs on weekends. So if you've got a chance on weekend, you can just trade on that Bitcoin. And then what I like about it, it pays very, very well, even with lower, lower lot sizes, it still pays very, very well. So as you can see, guys, for me, these three pairs that I just mentioned, they, they are forming one thing all the time. So we're going to be selling them all at once, right? So how are you going to sell it? It's very simple, but what you have to do is to get the nice entries there, okay? So looking at the US dating now, starting with, right? What are we looking at? We can get we can get the nearest demand zone, which is it's going to be this level here, right? This one will be our, our nearest demand zone, right? So let's check if we can get the, the nearest supply zone or the order block. So the next order block that we'll get will be will be this one here. So for you to add the order block, the order block should be correspond with Fibonacci, right? Remember, we don't use Fibonacci if we don't have a breakout. So we have a breakout here. As you can see, price has been bouncing on those level there, on that trend line there for three times, right? And then eventually price going down, feel to went up to, 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 to retest here. But now, as you can check, it looks like it's, it's about to go back to, to that level there to test before it can, it can just fall. So what we see here, guys, I see, okay, this is like a bearish flag formation. It's forming a bearish flag. As you can see, it's going to be, it's been doing, it's been doing this, going back to retest, right? It's doing, again, a bearish flag formation. So once it reached this level here, it's our time to, it's our time to sell. So another thing that we will just add will be your FIBO. You add it from that level there to this level here. So as you can see, that order block there corresponds with 61.8 of your FIBO. So we just have to wait for price to reach this level and then we sell it all the way down to this level here, which is going to be a very short term, short term sell, right? Okay, so like I said, it's very, very easy. This one, you just wait for price to reach this level. We sell it there, right? We sell it here, going all the way down. As for your stop loss, guys, you can just hide your stop loss about this high here, okay? About this high here, you hide your stop loss there or you can just hide it or you can just hide it here, right? And another thing that I'll quickly add will be the trend line coming all the way from that top there, okay? So you don't have to panic, guys. Even if price push all the way up to this level, it's going for it's going for that trend line there to form level three, where you should where you, where I always get nicest nicest entries there. So let's quickly move to crude oil and see what we get before we go to before we go to. Uh, before we go to Bitcoin, okay? Let's just get anything from crude oil. Okay, exactly. This is what we see on crude oil. It's the same setup as that at US 80, guys. You just have to highlight your order block there, right? Patiently, patiently, guys, wait for price to reach this level here. So for me, guys, this is for this week, this is free money, guys, okay? And then we sell it there going down, going down away. So this will be our nearest demand zone, but this will be our nearest demand zone, which some will call it a support where we take our profit there, which is going to be very, 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 very easy for you guys to go to go in there. So as you for your stop loss, guys, if you get a nice entry there using sell limit, okay, what you have to do, place your stop loss behind that, about that high there, looking at risk and what ratio it makes sense. Some will say, okay, it's a, it's a, it's a high risk one, and then you can just put your stop loss about, about which high, about, about this high this high here, okay? So just hide your stop loss there. So let's quickly go to, so this, as you can see guys, this has been as simple as simplest setups I can I can ever find. So let's go to Bitcoin to see what you can get. Okay, quickly let's go to Bitcoin to see what you can set like. This is what I see on Bitcoin as well, okay? So as you can see on Bitcoin, okay? Looking at 15 minute time frame, it looks like it's gonna, it's gonna, go all the way up to that level there because I've already done the analysis on this one. But if we go to H1, okay? Yeah, or even a, let's try H4, make it easy. Okay, correct. So this level here, if you get your far left, will be your, will be your shoulder, okay? This level here, your far left will be your shoulder to confirm that setup, this will be your, your first shoulder. And then you're expecting another shoulder this side here. 
and then this will be your head. So again, here it's forming a, a bearish flag, which is a continuation pattern. So once it reach this level there, guys, make sure that you place your sell limits there because you might not catch it once it reaches that level there. And then we sell it all the way going down to that level. It's the same setup as US 30 and crude oil. So your stop loss will be above your head, okay? So it's gonna be a very easy one, guys. We just have to sell, so without no hesitation, we just have to sell US 30 crude oil and Bitcoin. So guys, thank you very much for your time. I hope you understand the video. If you have any question, you can comment on the comment section below, guys. See you on the next one.